NATO is the world's largest and most powerful political military alliance, but its role is not just about military defense. The alliance promotes peace and security, largely through military and political cooperation, but also through science. NATO's Science for Peace and Security program, or SPS, brings together experts, academics, scientists, civil society and policymakers like you. You all come from NATO and partner countries, working together on today and tomorrow's security challenges. NATO's SPS projects have a clear security link and address one of the program's key priorities. These include tackling emerging security challenges, providing support to NATO-led operations and missions, improving early warnings and forecasts of disasters and crises through advanced technology, and by supporting the agenda on women, peace and security. All SBS activities are led by at least one project director from a NATO country and one from a partner country. Activities fall into three categories, training courses, workshops and multi-year projects. By offering training courses for those on the front line of the battle against terrorism, SPS activities assist global efforts aimed at countering IEDs or improvised explosive devices. Workshops bring together experts looking for solutions to security challenges, including in energy security. During Exercise Capable Logistician 2015, 30 experts from defense agencies and research institutes observed smart energy technologies in use and provided recommendations. In SPS Advanced Study Institutes, high-level tutorial courses are given by lecturers of international standing, updating experts and preferably young scientists on the latest advances in security-related civil science areas. Over the past five years, the findings and recommendations of these workshops led to over 50 patents, 400 peer-reviewed articles and 268 books in the NATO SBS series. Engaging young scientists is a strong focus of SBS-funded multi-year projects. These projects also develop systems with a direct security and military application. For example, scientists from Romania, Ukraine, Moldova and Finland are creating a multinational telemedicine system for emergency situations. These flagship projects enjoy a high degree of publicity. All applications undergo a peer review by experts before approval by allies. Over the past five years, this has allowed us and our scientific community to initiate over 450 collaborative activities of high scientific standard and with a security impact in more than 40 partner countries. Visit our website to access our guidelines and application forms and learn how you too can contribute to peace and security through science.